Hey yo, Gorilla Warzone. This is supposed to be the place where the primates play? Okay, but why is this proboscis monkey facing the ultimate alpha eight primate A? Should have kept this bulbous nose out before it. Grab the blunderbuss and bust with a wonder dust and throw this thunderous cunt under a bus that's traveling numberless to your final destination. Ticket invalid, creative stamped on, and that blood loss is more than just a leaking creative's tamp on this. Sanity pads facing insanity mad and sadly had the malady tagged as something curable, but it's not so I'll happily add a little something to the next tragedy's act, earn a gallantry badge because I've got four minutes to serve the agony bad. That's if diabetes doesn't beat me to it because to you, SSDI is the closest you've got to outside since never. Well, I'm a real mountain man, rugged, hard as fuck. I've been outside since forever, but bango chizzy's hide. Fuck this pretender. I'll pick apart parts of the person, point at the flaws because I'm a fax machine. And once you understand, you'll receive the message through screams like that of a fax machine. Off my nuts like that actor Sheen. And Charlie helps if I corpse create when I remove the IV. And it's a corpse I cremate to remove the ID. Or it's a corpse in a grave if you move the IV. Or it's a corpse in a... Fuck it. This week, the government banned zombie blades and choppers in the UK. So now, lockdown or not, we got to drill out with spoons. You know, all about prohibited items. Stealing things from your mum's floor on the room. Bro, you ain't creative if you're lacking a muse. Meant to get a brush off spoiled pigment. I need someone to translate from Jabba the Hutt's lingo just to understand what this spoiled pig meant. I mean, his waistline is bigger than my IQ and I'm fucking Einstein clever. Don't say me too. You're Harvey Weinstein clever while it's hog his trust up in some wank thing leather and he is some reality king I saw this pussy in round and brown issue 52 he was right there after the readers wise and the centre spread and Nola blue and we know the truth when you grew up poverty wasn't an issue that's clear from my research and my fact hunt so fuck off Lizzo with your sweaty adipose tissue round the vulva you stinking fat cunt I can help with your weight loss though bro an exercise regime where you simply have to shake your head how many times you ask Whenever somebody offers you food, I said. Now, you might not think I'm being creative, but I am creating something that's striped to your inner sight, where you know that deep, deep inside that grotesque body, there's a naked, fat, scared kid that clutches his bare bits, beats him, eats his spare ribs, then waddles up the stairs quick, fondles under the mattress and grabs for a spare twix. Two fingers down the throat, bulimia. Now nah, that'd be sharing, a long singing Ed Sheeran, but no one's in love with the shape of you. You push and pull like a huge celestial body's gravitational field do but that's enough of the fat jokes until this fat joke and that's a fat joe he's twice the size of fat joe and if that's so reveal parentage on a chat show would be the ultimate dad joke i'm watching whilst at home with a can of fat cone chasing storm status because you ain't got no backbone invertebrate stomp you increase the roach murder rate and range that rhyme with words that emerge from hate i see you've already eaten goma pile so tell me why do you deserve a plate I don't go in for all this new gender bollocks, but with you it's pretty indeterminate. Your chest size is 138, size chaffing at your dirty gate. Man pussy collecting semen like a naval recruitment place. In truth, I know that you'd skirt the date and she'd skirt the date and you'd go in sell and more than likely turn to rape. Fuck your self-esteem, you worthless gut bucket excuse of a dude. I'm staying trapped into this mood because in jest is truth. I know we got a complex, well now we got too complex to add another complex too. Perhaps a little context do because otherwise he's vacant like school when little Muhammad McKinley phones the bomb threat through. So fuck creative and his Chinese phone book number of chins. I came here and just shat on your name. Sitting on Jason's lap is the only way you would ever make an impact on the game. Now wobble off you lard ass nonce.